So we're at the Normandale Japanese Garden. That's why I got a skewel. Yeah. Got a bunch of information about it. That's really cool. Apparently it was res it was created or dedicated in 1976. Wow. So we're talking like 43 years ago, 42 years ago. Yeah. It's crazy. It's really pretty. We'll see when we get outside. It's just super tranquil too. It's like we walked in here and it was silent. Yeah, there was like no one here. We got some koi food. Gonna feed some koi. Yes. Once we find them. I love watching koi and goldfish eat. I like watching carp eat. Carp eating is fun. This is so cool. It doesn't feel like you're in Minnesota again. You know what I mean? Like. Yeah, it feels like you stepped into a little bit of a piece of Japan. Right. It feels kind of like it does when you're at Epcot. I don't know if you've, you've never been to Disney World, right? Not Disney World. I've been on a Disney cruise. Okay, well, so the bus that there, just passed but... by, that kind of ruined the illusion for me a little bit, but... Yeah. That's fine. This water's making me really thirsty. Yeah, I just had some water. I forgot my water in the car. Oh, oh, I saw it. I almost said you want it, and I didn't. Now it's too, like, warm for it to be really all that refreshing. Yeah. They have, oh, I think nice. they sell water bottles. That is I really cool. Yeah, I love waterfalls. I do too. Super pretty. I love water, like just in general. Me too. I would feel like super at home in the water. Or around water. Yeah. I'm, I grew up on the coast, so. I grew up on a lake, so similar. Yeah. Just, you had the ocean, I did not. Right. I had a lake. That's really cool right there. Oh uh, yeah, the little pagoda, I think is what they're called. That's really pretty. And the reason I know that is because they sell them for fish tanks and they're called pagodas. Oh yeah. <laughs> See, literally the only reason I know that word. That makes sense. So if nobody else knew that word, don't think I'm like super... Ooh, there's a koi. There's a nice size koi. Ooh. I'm gonna throw some food at it. <gasps> you got it. Yeah. Go me. Pretty. It's a pretty nice size koi. Yeah. There's another gold one over by that bridge right there. Oh cool, we'll pass it. We'll get some more. Oh cool. Did you want to feed some? Um, sure. Come on. Might have been old. They'll find it. Yeah. It'll get there. They're looking for it. <laughs> uh oh, look at the size of these guys. There we go. I know they're huge. <laughs> so those of you who think you can get goldfish and koi for fish tanks, you are incorrect. Yeah. This is the size they get. Even bigger. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I just read about that too. It's crazy. I mean, some of those gotta be, what, three feet There's long? One. That big one right there? That big white and gold yeah, one? Yeah, yeah. Gotta be at least three feet, or mm -hmm. around three feet. Crazy. Apparently, oh no, you're fine is a Midwestern thing. When somebody says, I'm sorry, like if they nearly bump into you or they do bump into you or whatever, you go, oh no, you're fine. Apparently that's a Midwest thing. Yeah. <laughs> I had no idea. I found that out recently. The Midwesterners are the only ones who take it. I usually say you're okay. The one that was over here is not here anymore. I thought I saw it over here. Did you? Right there? Oh, there he is. Oops, Oops sorry. sorry. Yeah, you're good. Oh, no, you're fine. <laughs> See, I said you're good. Ah, oh, good. A little too far. Ooh. 
on. Line. Okay, now you're going There are other, like, little things in there that are sitting. Look at that. Can you see that? Oh, really? Wait. Watch. Right around there now, you'll see, like, a disturbance in the water. Unless something out of the plane tricks on them. Yeah, way. I thought I saw that, too. There you go. Yay, he got it. I don't know. Maybe I'm just crazy. I mean, I know I'm crazy, but... Well, you know you're a fish, so... <laughs> well, we work in the pet industry for 10 years, yes. Yes. You learn, you learn a thing or two about fish and reptiles and fish and birds and ferrets and rodents. Mm-hmm. And rabbits. the rest of this other gold one. Okay. Unless you want to feed more. No, you're good. Okay. Where else do you want to go in here? Well, let's go over there. Okay. Saw some flowers. Too. Most times I don't. But this is nice. Sometimes I do. Yeah. I feel like I could just come out here and just like sleep. Yeah. I'm sure a lot of students do that. Cool. That was quite a breeze. Yeah. Strong wind. and sometimes they're really soft. This one's pretty coarse. Yeah. That's cool. I don't know why. I've always been obsessed with doing this since I was a kid. See, this one's pretty hard. I like pine trees, okay? <laughs> Leave me alone about it. You do you. I grew up in Minnesota, man. Pine trees. I know. Water doesn't look very clean. No. Oh, you have to clean it or do something. Hmm? You have to clean it someday. They just need to build up the filtration. And they might just have algae specifically growing specifically for the bacteria purposes. But Maybe. Which algae is not a bad thing. Necessarily, it can be. Mm -hmm. Algae's not necessarily a bad thing all the time. Yeah, it's really peaceful here. Super peaceful. So quiet. Yeah. Here we are, loud and eat up. Slightly. <laughs> so, my Minnesota history professor today, he goes, Look at this name, John Johnson. That's a pretty good Irish name. And I went, that's not an Irish name. That's like Scandinavian, man, come on. <laughs> and then he's like, what? Nobody's gonna argue that? That's not, a, that's not 
that's not an Irish name. Come on now. And I'm like, thank you. Okay, so you're just you were just trying to get a rise out of somebody. You weren't. Oh, good. <laughs> just talk to the Scandinavian about Scandinavian name. Yes. John Jr. Yeah. So that's how Scandinavians name people. Yeah. I can I can concentrate on what she's saying. But once she starts talking and explaining shit, I'm like. I think I really like cool if you go to thing. Oh cool. It's like almost like it could be a candle in there or like a fire stump of some sort in there. Like a lantern, you know? Yeah. Cool. That's really nice. I like it. Yeah, they're pretty. Sit, you know? Yeah, and breathe. He's surrounded by trees. Yeah. This is a plaque. Oh. We, the Japanese American veterans of the U.S. Army Military Intelligence Service Language School, dedicate this. Bentenda, Bentendo and Bridge to the people of the Twin Cities and all of Minnesota for the kind treatment we received while we were stationed here during World War II in 1942 through 1946. Ah, hmm. oh, we treated them nicely. That's good. It's called Minnesota Nice. Yes. <laughs> Climbing. <laughs> it's a pretty steep, like, arch. Yeah. Pretty fun walk around. Yeah. Wish it was inside. Which you wish it was inside? No, I said I wish I knew what was inside. Oh, inside this, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is a Japanese garden. It'd be nice if, like, they had explanations of what some of these plants are. Yeah. You know? That'd be really cool. Really weird, and I know they're draining Normandale Lake right now. Out there? I don't know if that is, but I wonder if it is because it looks weird. Yeah. They're draining it because there's some kind of like nasty bacteria in it. Hmm. I don't know, they do that from time to time. Put in it. Don't talk about their lake. The gods will get this is you. It's a really pretty view up here. <laughs> yeah, it is. Of the whole Japanese garden. It's a really pretty view up here. Minus the road, you can see the people, and you can also see one of the Bloomington buildings back there, too. But yeah. That's fine. You just pretend it's not there. <laughs> just pretend we're in Japan. Yeah. 
I'd like to eventually one day visit Japan. Yeah, that'd be really cool. I have a friend that went to Japan. I've got yeah. a few friends that have been to Japan. Yeah. Jealous. I know, I want to go to Japan so bad. Unfortunately, it's like not super high on my list right now. Mm. So I want to go to Australia and New Zealand, and I want to go to Norway and Poland. And my mom wants to go to Poland soon, so like. Oh, that's good. That's pretty much the top of the list right now, which is strange because for a while it was Australia, and then I was like, you know what? I've already planned my trip to Norway, so let's make Norway the top of the list. And my mom was like, but I want to go to Poland. All right. <laughs> <laughs> let's go to Poland. That'd be cool. Walk the same streets my ancestors did. And by ancestors, I mean my four times great grandparents who were who lived and died in Poland, or what was left of Poland at the time. Mm -hmm. This is really pretty. It is. It's really nice. Any final thoughts? <laughs> Just that it's actually a very nice day in Minnesota. It is. And I'm really glad I decided to take off this long sleeve sweater cardigan. <laughs> Yay! No more sweating in school. So bad. My hair is stupid long right now, so like... Seriously, somebody just bring me a scissors. I'm done. I'm just gonna chop it off. I'm gonna move on this sucker. Wrong country. But still, I'm gonna move on <laughs> this, this, this hair. You do you, girl. It won't look as good. Trust me. <laughs> <laughs> so you literally took the scissors away from me the other night. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm done! Oh. Uh, uh, that's a really pretty, really pretty spot. Yeah. And I, I've never been here. Like, I've been going to Normandale for, you know, two weeks. Um, mm -hmm. But I've always seen stuff about it. And, I'd like, and I was like, I want to go. And I was like, I'm going to wait for Dylan. That's nice. So, I'm glad I got to see it. Well, even if I had gone before, I think I still would have brought you. Yeah. But I'm glad I got to experience it with somebody else. So, pretty yeah, pretty. It's gorgeous. What are your final thoughts? I'm glad I came. And I think if you go to Normandale, you should definitely check it out. <laughs> Normandale Community College, Bloomington, Minnesota. And I'm here uh, these days and these times, so come and stop me. Just kidding. <laughs> Okay, bye. bye.